Hello and welcome to another edition of JPL in 30, the highlight show for the Jamaica Premier League. With one round to go before the playoff, the action is getting fever pitched as a couple of teams look to seal semi final berth at one end while others eye the sixth and final playoff spot. We begin our highlights package with one of the playoff aspirants, Waterhouse FC, looking to keep their noses out in front as they seek to hold on to the sixth and final playoff place when they take on Mullines United. Here are the highlights. The Ray Nephew at Jamaica Premier League into match week 25 here at the Anthony Spaulding Sports Complex. Beautiful scenes here in Kingston, Jamaica, in the parish of St. Andrew. Actually, Malines United against Waterhouse. It's going to be a tough game, and this is the team that Waterhouse and Malines will put forward. Yeah, Malines first. Sean Dua will be partnering Odin Samuels in that centre back. Region comes back in. Peter Harrison, of course, between the six, Sergini Franklin as well. We're playing in the wing back role today. Shamario Dennis comes into the starting lineup. Jeremy Nelson ever present. Javon Brown as well. Ronaldo Barrett. Johnny Flemings has recovered and is back into the starting lineup. And so too, teenager Devon Davis. Waterhouse, they will line up like this, playing their regular 4 3 3. Kemar Foster back from national duties. He's between the six. Shamari Dallas. Jaheim Brown comes into the starting lineup to play at right back. Interesting move. Elvis Wilson, Nikoi Christian, who spent some time out of the squad. Uh, their most creative player, Denada Thomas, who's had a bit of an off-key off -key season so far. they will be hoping for some consistency now. Leonardo Gibson in there, of course, from Mount Pleasant early in the season. Christopher Matthews, who made a transfer from Tivoli in the January window. Shamar Booth, Javain Bryan, second in the goal-scoring charts. And Rivaldo Mitchell, who has been good goal-scoring form as well. Alexi Perry, the man in charge, Waterhouse on the front foot from the get go. And they got a goal after just three minutes. Jaheim Brown into the starting lineup as a right back. Former St. George's standout. Jaheim Brown getting his first goal in the Premier League. Deflected header, but they all count. Rivaldo Mitchell with the assist. And Peter Harrison, no chance. Just to start, Waterhouse were looking for. And they got it. They were the only team showing attacking intent. Gibson into the area and Brian got that all wrong. He was wasteful today, Javain Brian. Quite a few opportunities for Waterhouse's number nine. He could have had at least a hat trick, could Brian. Here was another one of them getting into the area and just showed what he was doing way too early. Odin Samuels got in the block on that occasion and his shot was wide. Javain Brian. Waterhouse continued to press. This was a pitch of a pass from Nikoi Christian into Gibson who cut in onto the right foot but again hesitating way too long and he was closed down that was the best of the efforts from a Malines perspective Jason Wright from the dead ball it was heading to the top corner but Kemar Foster said no not right now digging it out and keeping the score respectable at that point this is into the second half and Brian look at that that should have been a tap in for their big number nine great work from Dallas on the left hand side couldn't have played the pass any better and Brian just needed to dink that beyond Peter Harrison instead hit it into the top tier Waterhouse they continue to come forward and look at this this is madness from Sergini Frankson not sure what he was thinking with a no look back heel pass to his goalkeeper Rivaldo Mitchell said well thank you very much rounded the keeper and just touched it into an open net it was number five on the season of Rivaldo Mitchell and Waterhouse finally breathing room, 2-0. That come in after some 65 minutes. Four minutes later, Dallas at it again down the left-hand side. Odin Samuels with a reckless challenge, giving away yet another penalty. And this time, Javain Bryan was accurate, to say the least. Sending the keeper the wrong way. 12 on the 13 now on the season for Javain Bryan and Waterhouse. Three points secure. That was after 69 minutes for Brian. They continue to drive forward. Nevada Blair coming on as a substitute. Two or three really nice deliveries, but they were not finished. The scoreline remained the same 3 0 to Waterhouse. Just four shots on target from 10 attempts for Waterhouse. One on target for Malines, which was a free kick from Jason Wright. A busy day, pretty busy day for Alexi Perry. Showed three yellow cards and there are 21 fouls in it. 
five corners for Malines compared to Waterhouse's eight. And surprisingly, Malines with a majority of the possession at 53%, but they have nothing to show for it. A blank sheet, to say the least. Waterhouse with a solid, decisive performance. 3-0, they defeat Malines. Lige Williams is the man of the match. The man with a goal and an assist, Rivaldo Mitchell. Yeah, Rivaldo Mitchell, today's man of the match. A goal and an assist for you today, but I have a feeling that you're disappointed. They probably should have had more. Yeah, I really thought I should have had more. This, is one of my, this is, isn't one of my good games, but I had a bad game and I still had a goal and assist. I had to take it. Um, feels good to help my team to stay in the top six now and be in the position that we're in. It just feels good. I guess it's a testament to your quality that on a bad day of yours, you're getting a goal of assist nonetheless. You mentioned uh, your team getting into the top six. That's a big aspiration of yours. How are you feeling with the team getting into the playoffs? Would that be a big achievement for you? Yes, that would really be a big achievement for me because this is actually my home. This is where I'm from. So to come here in my first season, knowing that they didn't make it to the top six last year, try my best to um, help the team going forward. The team is playing well. Everybody is um, very sharp. So I feel good going in, going in with the last game into the, um, with the first round. In the second round, sorry. Yeah, well, excellent performance today. A goal and assist for you. Hope the forum continues going into the playoffs as well. All right, thank you. We jump into our first break here on JPL in 30. Don't go anywhere. We have another mouth-watering encounter to come right after the break.